to control your garage via SmartThings, you need the Evolve Relay Switch, a power supply cable, the SmartSense Multi-Sensor, and the SmartThings Hub, if you haven't got one already. The setup is simple. Launch the SmartThings app, tap the plus button, and search for Garage. Select the Evolve Z-Wave module, and then select the Top Alerts and Action. Choose Control Your Garage Door. I have already configured my garage doors, but if you still need to configure yours, select Add a Door, and follow the on-screen instructions. Make sure you mount the multi-sensor in a vertical position as it uses tilt to detect if the garage door is open or closed. On the Evolve Relay, match the cables with the power supply and use electrical tape and wire nuts to hold the wires together. On your garage door opener, find the wires that connect to your push button and connect the wires in parallel to the switch, as shown in this diagram. Once mounted, make sure the relay is secure so it doesn't fall from the vibration of the garage door opener. Also, keep it away from the light bulb to prevent the relay from overheating. I noticed a minor issue with my smart garage opener. When I operate my garage door using the relay, the opener resets. However, it still continues to open and close the garage when I press the button and I do not mind as long as it does not damage the opener. The garage can still be operated normally using the keypad and home link in my cars. I can view and manage my garage doors from my phone. In addition, I can also create smart apps and reminders so I can be alerted if I left my garage open so I can remotely close it. The ability to connect your garage to your SmartThings hub is very helpful. I have listed the devices needed in the description. Please subscribe for subsequent SmartThings reviews and tutorials.